Die, potato, die. No! <laughs> Hello everyone, and welcome to the first episode on the Utopia Cubed, the Age of Adventure server, oh yeah, I'm swinging slow, oh yeah. <laughs> okay guys, I have been busy, uh, I have been playing quite a bit, I have I had two days off of school and I spent them settling in on the server, uh, I've done a lot of work on the server as I said. Uh, just because I didn't want to watch, uh, let you all watch again through all the hassle uh, that I have done in my single play world. Uh, if you haven't seen all of that and you definitely want to see me struggle with the tools. Well, I haven't really struggled because I found Tomium pretty early on. So I was pretty lucky on that part. But if you want to see me struggle a bit with like dying a lot at battle towers and stuff like that. I definitely recommend checking out my uh what's my call it my uh, single player world i have done before this so yeah uh what are we going to do this episode though let me grab me some food um i've played quite a bit already claimed the spot at spawn if you already see it, you know where it is already uh, <laughs> uh if you guys are uh, if you are uh, also on the server and you're looking for my base going to profound pole <laughs> i know it sounds pretty weird i have to change that still but it's these things are called poles, and it I have to name one of these. It I will explain it later on, <laughs> but it, it's really obvious. Um, I've made all my tools at the wonderful spawn uh, smeltery setup, blacksmith. It's a blacksmith bar, so it's a blacksmith. Yeah, uh, I've made all them tools uh, and uh, profound cleaver. It's basically just a cleaver with some stats. If you want to see them, you can pause the videos. Um, also a pickaxe, I've used it quite a bit, uh, a shovel, and a methog. Uh, I know you can use a methog as a shovel, but digging stuff like uh, other things than dirt and grass, it's really slow with. <laughs> so I also needed to make a shovel, so yeah. Um, this is a spot I've claimed with a statue of myself sitting on the ground, being a little bit lazy. And as you can read the bards, it's basically saying that I'm not building here right now. I just laid out some, uh, some, uh, some, uh, what's my call it, some uh, templates. Blocks, I think. Yeah, <laughs> I laid down some template blocks. Uh, let's light it up a little bit, uh, so people know what's going to be. It's going to be a giant ass tower, really cool. Um, I'm also playing, by the way, with Van Hel Van Hel on the server. Um, I'm constantly sp uh, saying his name as Van Halen, but that's that's someone else from another film or movie. Anyway, uh, this is going to be my shop. And uh, what's for kind of shop is going to be? Well, I've noticed on the server there's no blood magican on the server. Yes, I said blood magican because you're blood magic magican. <laughs> so it's blood magican in my eyes. <laughs> anyway, uh, this is not going to be uh, solely blood magic. I kind of want to make the tower up to here. Um, also, Namsa had a cool idea because I have, I first wanted to make it like uh, all from the basement up to here, but I think I'm going to uh, make it smaller at the top and then make a dome on top of it, a bit like this one. But I, I'm not sure about that. Everything is still interchangeable. That even is proper English. <laughs> so yeah, uh, I just uh, pluck. Uh, I just made a statue with. Uh, the sign I had at the beginning of uh, last episode, or uh, during the end last uh, of my last episode, and some bread because I was living on bread constantly, but I stole some pro uh, potatoes from Koyanche, so yeah, <laughs> uh, they, they, I, I like potatoes in Minecraft. Oh. Uh, let's swap this out then. <laughs> uh, can I shift click it in? Oh, <laughs> okay, can't wear a potato. 
Anyway guys, um, I'm now going to get to my base and I will show that up because I have been busy over there. So I will see you guys in a second. Alright guys, welcome to my humble about. Excuse me for that, let's shut it down right now. <laughs> welcome to my humble about. Um, this is just, um, it's it's a simple shack, I have to say, uh, uh, but I really like it. Like, it's, I don't know, it's just a, uh, a, a random generated building, but it's, it's I like it. I, I fixed it because it was ruined, but I, I have also been uh, really organizing, like, uh, I already have, like, nine diamonds. Well, ten actually, but, uh, oh, like, I already have ten, but I want to, to use one uh, here. Uh, already smelted up a bunch of metals. Well, it's not in there. It's here, I think. Yeah, it's here. Like it's in here. Um, I have also some bronze for some reason, but I have some tin, some iron, some copper. Some uh, I can't speak. I'm sorry. <laughs> some copper and some gold. Uh, I have also a sheep farm here. As you already heard. <laughs> I'm a uh, uh, we have some uh, mutton. Uh, we have here on the pack a. It's a little bit laggy, it seems to be. But here on the pack, we have a mod that adds. I want that thing. It's a little bit laggy, as I, as I already said, but uh, we will leave it. it. Anyway, uh, we have here some 8.1 8 features of uh, uh, that are supplied by Genny's Surface. He has added all kind of cool things that are from 1.8, like granite and stuff like that. Oh, <laughs> luckily I didn't, it didn't grow inside of me. <laughs> anyway guys, uh, I the thing I have planned for this episode is actually um, two things. I want to get to it. I want to get to, wow. <laughs> um, the, first things, the first thing I want to get into is, let's see... The quest book. Oh yeah, I'm definitely going to check out the quest book much earlier than uh, as I did with my single player world, because I'm now actually on the server, so it's way more exciting than it was on the single player. So let's open the quest book. And now, as you see, I've already showed this uh, like in my last uh, episode of my uh, single player series. Um, this page, but now it doesn't have like the additional stuff because of. Uh, I don't have to travel a long ways now. <laughs> and we see there's one quest open. Oh yeah. I see that our uh, basic survival. I already have done this because I came with this stuff. Yeah. I have to make it uh, be because I started here. But I didn't have made uh, this stuff. So uh, I think I'm going to craft it really quick. So I need, just need some wood. Oh, before I run downstairs I also need some string for the bow and I think this should be it yeah okay uh, first things first let's craft ourselves some blank patterns because they those are really needed oh, inventory is a little bit glitchy I don't know why but I think I have to reinstall my pack my uh, instance so let's craft all the things so we need one of these, uh, one of these, oh, these, <laughs> tool station, uh, I think I'm going to upgrade that immediately to a higher tier station, uh, let's see, we also need one of these, what's the last thing, I always forget that one, let's search up Tinkus Constructs, Tinkus Constructs, oh yeah, that's the block thing. Part builder. Yeah. Where did build a part builder? Tool station. Central table. That's the one I'm missing. It's just a plank. Okay. <laughs> cool, cool, cool. I think I'm going to start off with Tinker's Construct in here. So I will have the pattern chest there. Stencil table there. Part builder there. And let's see if I have any of these blocks, but I don't seem to have. So I can't upgrade my tool station as of now, but I will do that in between segments because I <laughs> just need to collect some things. I think I can already build it, by the way. 
No, then I have to tear down my thing and I don't really feel like doing that. So we have these things crafted. Let's see at our quest book. We need some stone, some stone tools. Let's see how many uh, blank patterns we have. Okay, we can craft those, I'm pretty sure. Just need some stone. Yoink. And eat in the meanwhile. Hom nom nom nom, hom nom nom. Nice and delicious potatoes. Okay, the things we need are shovel. Okay, just the heads of the tools. Okay, that 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 that's not too hard. Okay, I need one of these, one of these, one of this, and this one. Oh yeah. Um, let's dump these in here, and let's craft these things. So, yunk. Okay. And let's craft the other two things and let's see what our quest book says. Oh yeah, we only need to make ourselves a bow. Luckily I made myself too many sticks. So, oh yeah. And I already have done this. <laughs> I've done this just before recording, so claim reward, compass. Oh yeah. Compass is aiming to spawn. Oh yeah, cool, cool, cool. Oh yeah, I forgot I can't put this on a bowl. That's only with the... Uh, I need a chest. <laughs> I just want to dump my quest items for now in a chest so I don't need to run up all the time. So uh, let's do this. And let's dump these things. And let's dump these things. Let's dump the patterns. Okay, that's done. Okay, look at the next quests. Ooh, it unlocks some quest. Profession. Oh yeah. Merchant, freelanders, magic user, military. Ooh, military. Book and quill. I think I'm going to sleep a bit. Uh, see you guys in a second. All right, guys. Uh, I've been to spawn just killed uh, some cows because i didn't have any leather also i was i also didn't have any sugar cane and you need some for a book and quill so let's craft that right away i th think i have it right oh yeah i'm so awesome <laughs> i actually didn't know if that was the proper recipe but it was so yeah i'm happy now <laughs> i know something Anyway, let's grab the gold for this quest. Did I grab it? Nope, I didn't. I didn't know. So, let's submit. Oh, you need 10 gold. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Why do they have to make it that expensive? <laughs> anyway, uh, Smenimal submit. I get a bread. Oh. So awesome. Oh, yeah, and I can choose a profession. Um, let's read. I'm going to scroll down this. Uh, after that, I'm going to read it. And did it just reset? Did you saw that happening? Oh, God. No. Uh, can I still claim it? Yes. Okay. It's a repeatable quest then. Okay, cool. Oh yeah, um, I think that's. Uh, I, th I I may think that's uh, what just happened. Um, the problem we had is which item you choose here is basically your profession, and you need to like uh, give them um, at the profession basically. If you see here, um, let's see. I think I'm going to do magic user, and you need to basically give it here. The first problem we had with uh, that option is that you only can do one of the lines. If you want to do military, you can only do that once. Like basically, um, if you choose, oh, I clicked a bit, bit, bit too far back. If you choose at this quest, like for example, a magic user, you weren't able to like properly do this quest or something like that. So yeah. Necromancy, some other things. Ooh, freelancer. But I think I'm going for magic user. Oh, yeah. 
the reason why I'm going to choose magic user is because of blood magic blood magic is an amazing mod and I'm going to uh, think when I am um, pretty far into blood magic with uh, on this uh, on the server I'm going to do a tutorial a big tutorial about it so yeah I kind of stoked for that anyway uh, let's choose our profession right here right now claim reward oh yeah why did that sound played twice I don't know Merchant bag of holding. Hmm, interesting. Okay. These are some side quests. I think I'm going to do like three of them and then I'm going to continue to the next uh, part. And that is. Oh, I don't have to like. <sighs> okay. <clears throat> I don't have to like submit it or did it no i still have it so yeah i'm, I'm going to save this because this is kind of important for me i'm going to put it in an item frame pretty soon and i'm going to claim my sacrificial knife oh i thought the game crashed almost oh yeah i can sacrifice myself right here right now well not right now but <laughs> you get the gist let's see open Okay, I have to make myself a blood altar. Cool. Blood altar. I'm going to craft that also right now on camera. <laughs> it's so special when you see say like it's on camera, like it's it's not somewhere else. It's like I'm going to do this just for you on camera. I don't know why I'm like talking about this, but <laughs> uh, let's get that thing going. Uh, let's get the blood magic tap in front of us so I know what I'm doing. This is, any eye seems to be a little slow. I don't know why. Okay, I need two gold. And I think I have the rest of it. I think I have just two stone. Oh no, I have way more. I think I've smelted up some. Yeah. I'm prepared today, guys. Isn't that like really amazing of me? <laughs> oh, I already had a lot of tone, stone. So let's craft that and let's shift click that. Oh yeah, blood altar. Weak orb. Okay, now I need a diamond. And let's uh, let's place it in the middle of the room for now. So let's get rid of the torch. Well, I can leave that there. <laughs> um, the way the blood magic work is just basically simple. You stab yourself. And I hope I don't kill myself with this lag. Because sometimes the server is a little bit running behind. Or my client is a little bit running behind. Uh, and I need to put in a diamond. So yeah. This is basically now cooking up. If you can. Uh, yeah you can say it like that. And it will turn into a weak orb so I can show you the recipe of it uh, it's basically and you need 2000 LP I think I've put it in there but I'm going to refill it anyway because I don't want to derp up and uh, ruin it because if you don't have enough in here it still will work but uh, what's it called it, it will take more than it uh, needs originally so yeah It just turned into one. Cool, cool, cool. So yeah, uh, the thing we can do now with this thing is really awesome. Look at the usage. Oh, we can use it in a chemistry set. Chat set. I'm definitely going to use that for things like leather because I've a shit ton of uh, rotten flesh and flint, and water buckets are meh, easy to get. I don't think it will use up the bucket, so that's quite nice. But you have also some cool other recipes like uh, this, these uh, blood rune stones. And uh, this is the th first things we are going to do. So um, let me heal. Oh no, wait, wait. Before I'm going to cut here, uh, I'm going to claim my reward. And that's basically some adventure guide points. And let's see. We are now a almost an adventurer. We are already past a new recruit. Cool, cool, cool. Awesome. 
So we need two more points. Uh, let's try to get today to adventure. Okay, magic user. Oh, I need myself a slate and you get... Oh, okay. Uh, I'm going to uh, let me heal up a bit and I will be right back with you guys. Alright guys, let's sacrifice some more blood. Okay, and let's put it in here. I think there should be way more than enough blood to get started with the mod. So uh, let's grab our quest book with us really quick. Just need one slate and I'm going to take a quick look to the rest. Mana cookie. Oh, interesting. I'm definitely going to get into like... Uh, into one of the other magic mods, but for now we are going to start with blood magic. Oh yeah, we have... Ooh, we need a sigil. Uh, let's see if I have the... Oh, sorry for the black spike. If I have the... I think... Yeah, that should be exactly enough. Okay, stop cooking you. <laughs> I need this really quick. Uh, let's put this in here and let's grab some of the coal because we also need to smelt this stuff up. Um, let's see, uh, let's eat some more because I do want to regen. Uh, I hope I have at the... Oh, <laughs> I almost killed myself. <laughs> I was like, no, and I didn't die, luckily. So, uh, let's see. Oh. Slamming the doors into my face. Um, yeah, can I tell something about it? Yeah, I've done quite a bit today. Um. At, or entered yesterday uh, I've uh, I came at this building like uh, it was a bunch of blocks and stuff like that I fixed it up and I first had like chest or lockers there and lockers there but it became all messy and uh, all the stuff that was in these all all these chests well it was a little bit less but uh, most of the stuff that was were in these lockers not chests uh, were basically spread uh, uh, just dumped in four of them and yeah, you don't. You understand. You don't want to watch someone like just looking inside of uh, some lockers while they are recording. So I decided to like undo it and just uh, do something proper with it. So now we're going to craft the thing. Oh yeah, the fishing sigil. This thing is amazingly useful. Useful, not useless. Um, if you want to know how much blood is in here without Willia telling you, uh, you can just right click on it and you can see which tear it is and which altar and stuff like that. Um, you can also just right click into the air and see how much life points you have in your network. Uh, you can fill that up by putting a uh, thing, a blood orb <laughs> into the altar I think. Why is this not working? It should work. <gasps> oh yeah, um, if you get it, it's bound to no one and I just bound it, so it's bound to current owner to me. Uh, it drains 200 LP and if I put it in here, it will suck the blood up that's currently into oh, the altar. Pretty cool if you ask me. I'm going to let it suck up the blood and uh, yeah, I will be back. Okay, just sucked up all the blood and if you see in the chat, we have now 16,000 life points. Let me make that a little bit bigger. Uh, let's scale it back up so you can reach it easily. So you see it, it's all the way filled back up. Pretty cool, pretty cool. You can also refill it. Uh, excuse me guys, I just needed to cough so I, I hope I cut that out. But <laughs> if not, scream at me and I will... Uh, I won't fix it, but I will, uh, will, I will. I will kick myself in the nuts or something. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, let's look in the quest book. If you have, oh, uh, really? Do I really need to make these? I think I have. Um, I think I will do this off camera because it's just cutting myself a whole bunch and. Uh, like putting uh, the runes inside of the altar, get the sigils because this is recipe. So it's not that hard, but you just need uh, a bunch of blood. So uh, I'm going to do that off camera. Uh, so you don't need to watch to me doing this, uh, not painful project, but kind of boring project. 
So yeah, I'll see you guys in a second. All right, guys. Um, I was just busy uh, like stabbing myself and uh, doing some stuff. Until I came to the notice this is going to take a lot of time. Uh, I don't mind it really to be fair. But I kind of want to cheat the system. So uh, if you already see a Sime inventory. I have some Batania flowers. Oh yeah I'm going to start with Batania. Um, I'm sorry there was a little bit of a lag spike for some odd reason. Um, I know all of the other uh, people on the uh, all the other utopian. I think it's utopian, but all the other peoples on the server, um, including I think Van Hal is also doing it. Um, is doing Batania, but it's just such an amazing mod. A really amazing combinable with all the other mods, especially Tomcraft. If we look into this, um, the Lexia. The Lexica Batania, there is there are some uh, amazing things in it. Like, I'm looking for a flower that it's like regenerating my health because I'm getting kind of sick of tired of having having to wait till my health is regenerating. But um, oh um, oh wow! Excuse me for that, guys. Um, let's grab this one. Um, I think I'm going to take a look of how much time we have uh, because I think we are almost out of time for today's episode. So um, I will be editing this video and I'll see you guys in a second. Oh yeah. Alright guys. I think this is a nice wrapping up point for this episode. Next episode we are going to of course start with Batania, oh yeah. Um, I want to thank you all for watching this episode. I hope you enjoyed it just as much as me making it. I, I'm, I'm really excited for the first episode. I hope you definitely enjoyed it. I want to thank all the new subscribers for watching. And I want to thank all the old subscribers for staying. Oh yeah. Um, I, I just kind of blown away of how many subscribers already have I have like 60 subscribers and that's doesn't seem like a big number but it does mean a lot for me to thank you all for subscribing all for watching my videos and all the likes I, I, I it's just amazing if you have any questions about me uh, ask them in the description below because I'm thinking about doing a uh, kind of an AMA in uh, for a video or something like that i don't know um i'm going to prepare myself um, for the 100 subscribers special because i i'm thinking about making something special for that one but anyway guys i want to thank you all guys for watching uh, i'll see you guys in the next episode and don't forget to drop a like if you really enjoyed this episode that much so uh, thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in the next episode bye bye